Hello dear painting friends. It's been a while that we have seen each other. I am going to be painting a little bit on the tabletop world monument over here. And I'm going to be working on the stones, I'm going to shade them, wash them with these three colors. And if there's time also work on this little fellow over here. So while I'm painting over here, I also want to talk about the newest campaign, Kickstarter campaign from Tabletop World. They currently are with the Altburg graveyard set on Kickstarter. It's still running for a week when you see this video. So if you are in the market for a graveyard set and want to have it early, so in June, July, August, then you should probably get on Kickstarter. The link will be in the description and back this project. But let me tell you shortly that this is again a really stunning kit that Tabletop World has produced. It consists of various buildings. There's also walls for encircling your graveyard. And of course, there's also a church as an add on. And that church is stunning. I really fell in love with the church. And if you're backing the campaign and you are also getting the church, then this time around during this campaign, you will get the free church accessory set. So you will get a monk and a few benches and other extras, which will look really good in that church, as you can see from these painted examples. They are all from Tabletop World. Ivan has painted them. I also linked his Instagram account and blog in the description. He's a very talented painter and is really inspiring me to up my painting game. So yes, um, everybody that pledges over a hundred dollars is also getting the corpse card for free, which is a really cool little scenic extra that will look stunning. Also without a graveyard around it, because I do think that you can use it also as a little card for groceries or for other things that is like a farmer bringing to town, for example. So yes, if a graveyard is something that you fancy, maybe you're playing a religious order or like me, maybe you are playing the protectorate of Manet in War Machine, also a religious order, then a graveyard is really something that you want to have for your minis, then you should now get on Kickstarter and support them. Of course, you will also be able to buy this later on. So these things will be coming online in the tabletop world shop later in the year in autumn, I reckon after all the backers have received their kits. And yeah, I think it is a stunning piece. There's so much in there. So you will not run out in a short time of things to paint with this set. I think it will be a lot of fun. I am really looking forward to working with it when I receive my pledge in June. So I was lucky enough to get in early and I really am anticipating my graveyard kit from Tabletop World. Other than that, I am also tempted to put this monument maybe in there that I am already painting over here right now. I do think that it actually might look pretty nicely in a graveyard as a little centerpiece. Maybe this little dude over here this bronze dude was a really big hero and this monument is his special tomb or grave that is made 
just for him. I don't know. I do think that this piece could look really good. But yes, uh, if you want more information, just head to the Kickstarter page from the Graveyard Kickstarter from Tabletop World and pledge even if you are right now short on money. After all, we are all having been suffering from the pandemic, lack of work in many cases, then you can just pledge for a minimum amount and then use the pledge manager later on to add more funds and get some of the stuff. Maybe as a final notice too, also again, that um, this being a Kickstarter, there will be some stuff that will be limited. So that will be only available on the Kickstarter. So for example, the Grave Digger hut is only available during this Kickstarter. And if you want it, because you say that also would make a really cool hut for some workers or something else, then you should grab that while it is on Kickstarter. And of course, you also can grab it later via the pledge manager. So you can just now add a dollar or two and then later pay the rest for it. But once the Kickstarter is over and you're not backed it, then this Gravedigger hut will not be available anymore. The church, on the other hand, as I already mentioned, will be available, but quite late after everyone else that has supported them on Kickstarter has gotten their gear. Yeah, this is going forward quite nicely, quite quickly actually too. I really like these washers. They add so much feeling. If you want to hear more about how to paint a piece like this, please check out my how to paint ultra realistic stone walls video. It's exactly the same kind of techniques that I'm using in that video that I am now using over here. And there you will see a complete list of the colors used and some tips and tricks on what to pay attention to. Well, in that sense, thanks for checking out my short painting session. If you got questions, leave them in the comments. I will be back with a more in-depth video soon about this little project. But more on that in the next video. Thanks for watching and have a great painting evening or day.